Hello students, welcome to today's math class. So, continuation of this frequency distribution tables and graphs that is the 7th chapter in our textbook. And we are in the first exercise, last uh, uh, maybe 4 problems left in the last exercise. So, in this we studied about the mean, median, mode. All the concepts are over, no new formulas, just we can continue the problems. So, in the last class, we completed the 16th one. So, uh, first let me tell 18th one. All of you read the 18th question, students. Read 18th question. If the mean of the set of observations is 20, see here. x1, x2, x3, so on, x10. This, this, see, this, see, these numbers are given. What are the numbers? x1, x2, x3, so on, x10. What is the mean? Mean is, mean means what? How to find the mean? Sum of the observations by number of observations. See, x1, x2, x3, up to x10, this is the data. What is its mean? First number plus second plus third plus fourth plus fifth plus sixth plus seventh plus eighth plus ninth plus tenth. By how many numbers? Ten numbers. This is given as how much? Twenty. Twenty. The answer is given as twenty. Students, x1, x2, x3 up to x10, the numbers are given. How to find its mean? First number plus second plus third plus fourth plus up to x10 by how many numbers are there? 10. Mean or average. Mean formula is sum of all the observations by number of observations. But answer is given as 20. See, don't write x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 plus x5 plus x6 plus x7 plus x8 plus x9 plus x10 is equal to 10 into 20 is 200. Keep it. See these are the given numbers. Up to 10. So its mean is sum of all the numbers by 10. Answer is 20. 10 into 20 into 10 is 200. Leave it. Actual question is Actual question is we are asked to find the mean of these numbers. See. Given data. See here x1 plus 4 x1 plus 8 uh, x2 plus 8 x3 plus 12 x10 plus 40 x1 plus 4 x2 plus 8 x3 plus 12 so on x10 plus 40 what is the mean of these numbers? That is the question. See, mean of these numbers is given. 20, we are not asked to find the mean of this. That is given. But from that we got one rule. One important uh, 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 relation we got. x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 plus x5 plus x6 plus x7 plus x8 plus x9 plus x10 is equal to 20 into 10 is 200. Keep it. How to find the mean of these numbers? Same procedure. Mean we are from the beginning almost all maybe 10 to 12 problems we solved a mean, mean uh, model. Mean is nothing but sum of all these numbers by how many numbers? 1, 2, 3, 4 up to 10 numbers. So how to find the mean of these numbers? See here. Don't write. 
क्वेश्चन इज वॉट इज द मीन ऑफ दिस डेटा हाउ टू फाइंड द मीन मीन आर एवरेज आर एटिमेटिक मीन ऑल आर सेम सम ऑफ द ऑब्जर्वेशन बाई नंबर ऑफ ऑब्जर्वेशन सी एर फर्स्ट नंबर सेकेंड नंबर थर्ड नंबर फोर्थ नंबर फोर्थ नंबर मीन्स फोर एट ट्वेल्व फोर फोर डिफरेंस फोर एट एट प्लस फोर ट्वेल्व ट्वेल्व प्लस फोर सिक्सटीन लाइक दिस फॉर एक्स टेन प्लस फोर्टी बाई हाउ मेनी टर्म्स टेन ओनली गिवेन दैट फर्स्ट डेट ऑल्सो हैविंग टेन टर्म्स Here also these are ten numbers. Why ten numbers? Because see, x one first number, x two second number, x three second number, third number, x four fourth number, x ten tenth number. So how many numbers? Ten numbers. See, these are the numbers we are asked to find its mean. Mean is very simple. Simplification may be difficult, but process is simple. What is the process? Add all the ten numbers. By divided by ten, like we take marks average, six subjects marks we add divided by six like that. See students, don't write. I am writing all this in separate black. X one I wrote, X two I will write, X three I will write, X four I will write up to X ten in separate bracket plus. First numbers I am writing in a separate bracket. X one plus X two plus X three plus X four plus X five plus X six plus X seven plus X eight plus X nine plus X ten in a bracket. Remaining numbers, sorry, this is uh, X one plus four. Remaining numbers, students, four, eight, twelve. Sixteen. Write full. We can write because four four difference. Four plus four eight eight twelve. Four table. Four table. Four ones are four. Four twos are eight. Four threes are twelve. Four fours are sixteen. Four fives are twenty. Four sixes are twenty-four. Four sevens are twenty-eight. Four eights are thirty-two. Four nines are thirty-six. Four tens are forty. Last number is. Forty students. Last number is forty. See, this is this is the first term, second term, third term. Like the ten terms are given. Find its mean. Very simple rule. Mean formula is add all the ten numbers. First number plus second number plus third number up to ten numbers divided by ten. How to add these numbers? First, I will write these unknown values in a bracket, separate bracket because x one we don't know. X one is here, X two is here, X three is here, up to X ten in a separate bracket. These are known numbers. Four is known number, no? Four, eight, twelve, sixteen. After sixteen, twenty, twenty-four, twenty-eight, thirty-two, thirty-six, forty. By how many numbers? Ten. See students. This total value is two hundred. X one plus X two plus X three plus X four up two X ten is two hundred. Total value is two hundred. You add this all these numbers. This plus this two hundred you add divide by ten. That is the answer. What is the sum of this? You add. Just add four plus eight to twelve to twelve to twelve twenty four thirty six like that. Add all the numbers. Here this. Are they known? The value is known. Like this. So this already answer is two hundred. You can just write down two hundred in this here. You add all this, you will get some number. This plus this you add. What is this? Two hundred. So this plus two hundred you add and divide by ten. That is your answer. So this is the procedure. But simplification is little lengthy. So here you have to add these numbers. And writing also because ten terms. No, I put all the ten terms here. Or you can write first three and you can put dash 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 last one like that also you can write. So what are the first given numbers? X one, X two, X three up to X ten. How to find its ultimate mean? 
first number plus second number plus third number up to 10 numbers by 10. But answer is given as 20. It is given in the book, textbook, problem. So 10 into 20 is 200. Leave it. Actual question is find the mean of these numbers. How to find the mean? So first number plus second number plus third number plus fourth number plus last tenth number. By how many numbers? 10. X1 plus X2 plus X3 plus X4 plus R X10. 4, 8, 12, 16 up to 14 separate. Write down students. Write down up to here. See. I will rub it and I will continue. So first write down up to here. Students, what is this answer? 200. You add all these numbers. Don't get confused how we got 200. It is equation 1. 4 plus 8, 12. 12 plus 12, 24. Plus 16. 24 plus 16 is uh, 40. 60. 60 uh, 84 92 1 to 12 you add 200. Next, if we take 4 common, little easy. 4 common, 4 is 4 into 1, no? 4 common, 1. 8 is 4 into 2. Friends, 4 is 4 into 1. 8 is 4 into 2. 4 outside, 2. 12 is 4 into 3. 4 outside 3. 16 is 4 into 4. 20 is 4 into 5. 4 outside, so 5. be easy to add. You can add like this also. This is easy to add. 1 plus 2, 3, 10. This total will be 10 into 10 plus 1 by 2, uh, 55. 1 plus 2, 3, 6, 10, 15, 21, 28, 36, 45, 55.
42 is the answer students concept is simple but simplification is little lengthy Forty-two. This total is two hundred. How do we got from equation one plus four common? This will be one. This will be two because eight is four into two. Four outside two. Four into one, four. Four two is eight. Four three is twelve. Four four is sixteen. Like that. Nineteenth question. Numbers from the list of nine digits are write down six numbers from the list of nine digits. Six numbers from the list of nine numbers are. Seven, eight, three, five, nine, five. Friends, the given numbers are seven, eight, three, five, nine, five. Six numbers are given. I wrote. Actually, there are how many numbers? Nine numbers. See. These are the six numbers. I will find the median for this. I will explain the question afterwards. Step by step, I, I will explain about the question. So now I am not right going into the question. First, I I wrote the six numbers as it is. I am writing in the ascending order. Smallest to greatest. See here. It is the smallest number three. Five, smallest number. Three, five, five, seven, eight, nine. This is the ascending order. See the typical typical question. That means some some twisting. Six numbers are given. I wrote in the ascending order. That's all. I did not do anything. Just ascending order, smaller to greatest. Three, five, five, seven, eight, nine. Now there are three more terms. Total nine terms. Total how many terms? Nine terms. There are nine terms. Three more terms. You write. Three terms. What what numbers you don't know? Whether they are less than three, or they are in between this. Suppose four is there. We are right here. Suppose ah uh, uh, maybe five point five something. So integers means decimal, no decimals. Only your 
numbers only. So that means it may be less than this. This may be two or that may be one, like that. So uh, or here that may be ten or eleven, twelve, like that. Any numbers. So there are three more numbers. What numbers we don't know. But the you highest. The question is, what is the highest uh, medium? Find the largest possible value of the median of all the nine numbers. See here, students. Ma highest possible median. So highest possible median means I will explain two cases. Then you decide which is the correct one. See here. See here. Three, five. Don't write. Only for explanation, I am writing this. integer means you can't take decimal so three more numbers means what may be the three numbers they may be this side they may be one in one may be two one integer means zero also will come negative numbers also will come suppose for example numbers up 355789 are given numbers so three more numbers you tell where the three numbers may be less than three Like this, one, two here, one here, zero here. Not only two, one, zero. I give some example. Less than three. In this case, what is the median, students? You tell the median. Three, three. Middle value is the median, no? Three, three, five, five. Five is the median. Or okay. suppose the three numbers are. You go greater than nine, for example. So then, suppose three, five, five, seven, eight, nine, seven. For example, example ten, eleven, twelve. Greater than nine. Let us assume three numbers may be less than three, or may be greater than nine. Or may be four. Four possibility also there because four is not there. No. Or three may repeat. Five may repeat. Seven may repeat like that. Uh, any 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 numbers. So here, uh, so if it is greater than nine, means ten, eleven, twelve. What is the median of these numbers? What is the median, students? This three three cancel two two three five five seven eight nine ten eleven twelve. For example. In this case, median is eight. In this case, median is eight. So, which case? What is the maximum median? Largest median in these two, which is greater? Eight. If you take any other possibility also, suppose if you take any number, any repetitions, anything, so greater than eight will not come. So, eight will be the maximum median. Suppose if you, if instead of ten, eleven, twelve, suppose if you take twenty. Thirty, forty, also. In this case, also median is eight only, because four digits, four digits middle is the median. So that means whatever may be the numbers, whether they are less than or greater than, highest median will be this one eight only. Highest median will be eight. For largest median, you take the larger numbers. You take greater than nine. Whatever numbers you take greater than nine, it will not affect the median answer because median does not depends on all numbers. Middle one is the median. So what is the median here? Eight. In this case, suppose if the numbers are less than this three, in this case what is the median? Five. So largest median is eight only. You take any other numbers, maximum possibility is eight only. If you take any other numbers, median will be less than eight. So maximum is only eight. That is the conclusion. So, for max largest numbers, let us take the numbers greater than nine. If whatever numbers you take, suppose hundred, two hundred, three hundred, also median is eight only because middle one is the median. That is the conclusion. Right now. For for largest median. For largest median, for 
let us assume that for largest median let us assume that remaining three digits are greater than nine largest means larger numbers i am taking for largest median let us assume that remaining three digits are greater than nine greater than nine greater than nine let the numbers be x1 x2 x3 only for explanation i am taking like this. let the numbers be i explained 10 11 12 but specific numbers we should not write no let us take the numbers as x1 x2 x3 all these are greater than 9 for example let the numbers be x1 x2 x3 then List of numbers will be list of numbers will be first number is three, second number five, next number five, next number eight, next number nine, next number nine, eight, nine, three, total nine numbers. Five, six are given, three are not given. Let us assume that uh, the remaining three are greater than nine. So let it be x1. Next to be x2, next to be x3. So I am assuming this side because largest median we have to find. If you take this side, you will get small median, less median you will get 5 we got now. But largest is asked. Largest means we take, let us take the larger numbers. More than 9. More than 9, any number, maybe 1000, 2000, 300 also, 3000 also greater than 9. Any number greater than 9, let us take. Now in this case, what is the median? Which is the median? Middle number is the median. So four, four numbers. Middle is the median. Eight is the answer. Or directly you can write eight. Or you can do like this also. N is equal to how much? Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine numbers. So what is the rule? This is odd. So when it is an odd number, what rule I told? N plus one by two. That means 9 plus 1 by 2, 9 plus 1 is 10, 10 by 2 is 5th term, 5th term is the median, 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th term is the median, therefore median is equal to how much? 8, so 8, is, 8 will be the largest, even if you take any other numbers greater than 8, we, can't, we won't get, because 8 will be the maximum possible median, uh, maximum largest possible median, so median is equal to 8. So this is the procedure. Actually, there are nine numbers. Only three numbers are six numbers are given. I wrote in the ascending order: three, five, five, seven, eight, nine. There are three more numbers which are not there. We are not asked to find the three numbers. Whatever may be the numbers, answer is we have to get maximum median, greatest. So let us assume that three numbers are big numbers because largest means let us take big numbers. Big numbers means more than 9. So more than 9 means if you are right in the ascending order, uh, smallest to greatest. Because these numbers are greater than 9. So we have to write after 9. One number may be 10, maybe 20, maybe 30, like this. For these numbers, what is the median? Median is the middle one. Directly you can write. Or I gave this rule. It will, you will get one more extra step. This will be better. Professional. So how many terms are there? 9 numbers are there. N is equal to 9 numbers. So when it is even, another rule, odd, another rule. Odd, I gave this rule. N plus 1 by 2. N is 9 terms plus 1. 10 by 2. Fifth term is the median. What is the fifth term? First, second, third, fourth, fifth term. So median is equal to 8. Therefore, largest median. Largest will be 8 only. Uh, more than 8, if you take any numbers, you can try with any numbers, you won't get greater than 8. If, if you take numbers this side, it will be less than 8. So, maximum is 8. This is the answer.
So understand this question, understand the concept. It is, a, it is like a reasoning type question. Largest median is gained answer after this. All of you read the 20th question students. Over. Students, for this also, there is no solution, just we are writing the answer, but I will explain it. Nine numbers are there, median is 20. See, I don't write, only example I am giving, we should, it is not a part of the solution. Nine numbers. Students, these are the nine numbers. What is its median? Middle one. Four, four number. Middle is the median. See here. What is the median? Twenty. Which is our uh, median of nine digits is twenty. So uh, accordingly, I, I adjusted the numbers. Then what is given? Last four numbers are increased by two. See here, last four numbers are increased by 2. If you, uh, this 25 will become 27, 2 is added. This is 28, this is 33, this is 44. Last four numbers increased by 2. So if increase by 2, they will not come this side. No? So that will be greater, will be in greater side only. See here, again I am writing numbers. 5, 6, 10, 15, 20. Last four numbers are increased by 2. This becomes 27, this becomes 28, this becomes 33, this becomes 44. Last four numbers are increased by 2. Then what is the medium for these new numbers? What is the medium for these new numbers? Medium means middle number. Last, last, can, last four cancel, last four cancel. 20 is the median. Now also median is same. If last four numbers are increased by 2, now, then also median is same. So what is the answer? Median is 20 only. How? If last numbers are increased by any number, median doesn't change. Starting numbers also increased by any number, increased by some number. So uh, some number, that means it should not cross 20. So in that case also, that means extreme values are add, uh, little changes also, uh, there is no effect on the median. So therefore, last four numbers are increased by some number, median remains same. So write down the data. No, don't write any solution, just a conclusion. Median of nine digits is equal to 20, that you write first step. If Last four digits are increased by two.
increased by 2 then it doesn't change the median doesn't change the median because because median doesn't Because median is not affected by, not affected by any changes in the extreme numbers. Median is not affected by changes in the extreme numbers. Median is not affected by changes in the extreme numbers. Therefore, median of new numbers is equal to 20 only. First time 20, second time also 20. Because see here, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. Students, what is the median for this? 5. Suppose, instead of 9, I added 5. So 9 plus 5 become 14. Now also median is 5 only. Suppose for 9, if I add another 9, it becomes 18. Now also median is 5. That means these extreme numbers, if changes are happened, no change in the median. If the given first data is having 20 median, next data will also have 20 median because extreme values doesn't affect the mean. That's so one problem left that I will teach in the next class. Tomorrow is Sunday. So anyway on Monday I will continue this chapter students.